The second part of season 5 of Lucifer just aired, and we couldn't be more excited. Leaving of the first part on the cliffhanger when Lucifer's dad, God, came to Earth, left us wondering what could happen next. Well, we managed to pull together some of the best moments from the show. So if you want to find out more, keep watching because here are the 10 best moments in Lucifer Season 5A and 5B. Number 10. Michael's Entrance Starting off the show, we have a brand new character to join the cast, this time Lucifer's twin brother Michael. In the beginning, he spends most of his time pretending to be Lucifer while he is still away in hell. He tries to get close to Chloe, but being the detective she is, she noticed that something was just not right. She ends up shooting him to prove that he is not Lucifer. Even though Chloe managed to prove that he is not who he says he is, she still didn't reveal everything she knows. Given how big of a manipulator Michael is and how many times he has pretended to be Lucifer, when Lucifer came back from hell, he decided to give him a scar on his face so they can tell the two brothers apart. Number 9. Dan Sees Lucifer's Devil Face Since the beginning of the show, Lucifer has never hidden the fact that he is the devil. Throughout the show, more and more people have seen his true form. But the only person that has been left in the dark all this time was Dan. Even though Lucifer never wanted Dan to see his true form, Michael had other plans in mind. As Lucifer and Amenadiel are playing with baby Charlie, Michael calls Dan pretending to be Lucifer, asking him to go back to the house. As Dan returns, he sees Lucifer's devil face and is left speechless. When he confronts him in front of Chloe, he ends up shooting Lucifer, and when he notices that nothing has happened, he literally lost his mind. With Amenadiel and Charlie, I came back and I saw his his freaking scary ass red face. Well, I'm not particularly fond of your face either, Daniel, but you don't see me trying to kill you. Number 8. Linda Meets Her Daughter We all know that Linda has a half-demon, half-human baby with a minideal. But what no one knew is that she had a baby girl that she gave up for adoption back in the 90s. Fans were super shocked and excited to see where this storyline would go and how it would evolve. The scene where Maze and Linda pose as a couple trying to buy a house that Linda's daughter is selling is quite golden. You can see how much they actually look alike, and you can see Maze's excitement over it and how much she wants Linda to tell her who she is. But even though Linda kept quiet that she is her mother, she truly got a chance to know her just a bit and that she truly made the right decision back in the day, given how well her daughter turned out. Number 7. Decker Star the moment we have all been waiting for has finally happened in Season 5. Lucifer and Chloe have finally got together and made all of us Decker Star fans quite happy. It might have taken us four and a half seasons to see this, but we never lost hope for the amazing couple. Since the beginning of the show, each one of us hoped that one day they would end up together, and frankly, we wouldn't have expected anything else. But as the show went on, we were scared that maybe the couple wasn't meant to be. In Season 5, all of that changed when Lucifer came back from hell and Chloe figured out just how much she wanted to be with him. We were honestly so happy for them and hoped to see them together in the sixth season as well. Number 6. God It's no news that Lucifer has his fair share of daddy issues, as he knows to joke about it constantly. Throughout the show, there were moments where he mentions his father, God, multiple times and we often wondered whether or not we will ever meet him. We already met his mother, the goddess, early in the show, so now it's time for his father. We were quite shocked when we saw the scene, to say the least. The three brothers fighting against each other seemed a little heartbreaking for God at least, since he decided to come down from heaven to break up the fight, saying he hates it when they fight. This moment was the perfect ending to season 5A and left us wanting more and more, trying to figure out why God is on Earth. Number 5. Family Dinner Starting off Season 5B, we pick up right where we left off, with God on Earth. We get to see a scene where all three brothers, Lucifer, Michael, and Amenadiel, together with their father God, having a family dinner. This scene was quite sweet, if we say so. But it was also kind of hard to watch just how much Lucifer craves for his father's love and attention. We were happy to see them finally have dinner as a family, but given that God wouldn't answer the questions that Lucifer had, made Lucifer mad and ended up destroying the dinner. But all of that aside, 
The scene was really nice to see after four seasons of only hearing about how cold and distant his father is. I just want him to admit to the fact that he's a bad father. Number 4. The Fight Even though Lucifer and his father were off to a bad start, eventually they made amends and God even said that after everything, he truly loves Lucifer. God revealed the purpose of his trip, announcing that he is retiring and going off to live with the goddess in her world. That meant only one thing. Who will take his place? Michael and Lucifer both wanting a chance to be God only made them get into a fight. Michael takes out the flame and sword, but as they struggle with the sword, Chloe decides to pull out the key and put a stop to all of it. When Lucifer goes after the sword, Asriel appears, the angel of death, saying, I'm sorry, Luke. And at that moment, Michael stabs Chloe, leaving her to die in Lucifer's arms. Number 3. Lucifer brings Chloe back to life. If that last part didn't make you cry already, we are certain this one will. After Chloe died and went to heaven, she reunited with her father, but back on earth. Lucifer was furious and refused to accept her death, so he decided to go to heaven and bring her back. He flies to heaven and survives the journey thanks to the immortality ring. He finds Chloe and tells her she needs to go back. This moment was probably one of the sweetest ones in the show because it shows that Lucifer is ready to sacrifice himself for Chloe as he hands her the immortality ring so she can go back. In that act, he starts burning as he tells Chloe he chooses her and loves her. Number 2. Maze and Eve Let's take a little break from Decker Star and put our focus on some other eventful moments from the show. Maze and Eve We had some thoughts that maybe these two might end up together, but up to this moment, nothing was certain. Maze found out that she had been given a second chance when Eve returned to her and realized that she has grown a soul thanks to all the time she has spent building relationships with people on Earth. This was such a well-deserving thing for Maze and Eve also, since they have been through a lot in the past few seasons. And we already knew how much Maze was looking for a soul, so having one definitely made us happy. Number 1. Lucifer Becomes God And we save the best for last. Given all we previously mentioned about the fight between the two brothers and the death of Chloe and how Lucifer brought her back, well, it was said that once Lucifer got to heaven, he would die. So, he sacrificed himself so that Chloe could leave. But what we didn't expect was for Lucifer to come back. When he did, everyone was surprised and didn't understand how that happened, including Lucifer. With the flaming sword in his hand, and the unanimous vote from all the demons that they support him in becoming God. He claimed the part and replaced his father in the last few minutes of the last episode of the show. On a related note, we wanted to know, which moment do you think was the best from the entire season 5 of Lucifer? Let us know in the comment section below. If you'd like to see more amazing videos such as this one, make sure to like this video, subscribe, and hit the bell icon so you never miss any of them. And as always, Thanks for watching, guys.